What's up, y'all? If you're not new, welcome back. And if you're new, welcome. Welcome to our little clan, our little fam, our little whatever. Today, we will be creating this look. Avatar, princess, whatever you will. It's Avatar, basically. Avatar, um, like the movie that's gonna come out. I actually did this look two years ago, and you guys have been begging me for me to do it again. And so I did it again because you know how I feel about y'all. I love yous. But I'm about to go out in public. I'm gonna record that for you guys because you did ask for it two years ago when I did it. But by that time, I'd already taken off the makeup, didn't have the motivation to put it back on. So now that I have, I will do it. I'll holler at you guys later and I hope you enjoy the video. I'm sorry if you guys can hear the AC in the background, but it is hot as balls today. And if the AC isn't on, then I will die of heat stroke, and then you won't have me anymore as a content creator. And would you like that? No. So it's like, would you rather suffer with the AC sound, or would you rather suffer not having me on Earth anymore? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what I thought. What it is? Anyways, hey guys, it's me, Jalika. Welcome to my channel, Jalika. Today I will be working on doing an avatar look. So first things first is I'm going to remove all of my jewelry so that I don't get blue on them because I will be airbrushing my ears and like my neck and all that good stuff. Oh, man. It smells like manchego cheese. That's what it's that's what it's giving right now, is what it's smelling like unfortunately. I'm gonna take off my necklace so I don't turn blue. All right, now that the jewelry is off, I need some water so I'm not clearing my throat consistently this whole time. Water, agua, good for the soul. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. All right, so. We're going to start putting in the contacts. I'm gonna go ahead and cut this open. I'm not good at opening things with my nails, guys, so I gotta use utensils. I don't know if that was the right word. Is a scissor a utensil? A tensile, if you will. I don't know, guys. I just, I'm just doing whatever. Does anybody really know what they're doing? <laughs> okay, so this is what they look like inside of the little packet. Ding, 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 ding. My voice is still a little bit hoarse from screaming my lungs out at my little brother's basketball game two nights ago. Did it work? <gasps> it worked! Okay, well, <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Sharp pay onto something I should have known. So I got this little thing. I don't know where I got it from, but I've had it for a little while. So. It's, you know, little wings and halo. It doesn't matter. It's just, it's going to be used to protect my hair. Wait, is this the right way? No, it's not. It's going to be used to protect my hair from the airbrush makeup that I'm about to put on it. All right. So, we have it on her neck. We're going to pull it above like this because we don't want blue all up in our edges. If it does like get like on the smallest amount of edge, that's fine because we can wipe it off. But the rest of the hair is gonna be a no from me, dog. Mm -hmm. Now, you guys don't laugh at me, okay? Don't, don't, don't laugh. It's not, it's not funny. And don't say I look like a Teletubby either, cause that's just not nice. I'm like, what do you say fuck me for? So, I'm about to go ahead and put on these contacts, y'all. And I'll be right back. Child, they just look like regular green contacts. Look at them. They look like regular green contacts. And I thought they were going to be like more like yellowy. But maybe it's just because my eyes are brown. I look like Michael Ely. Anyways. We're going to work with this. Okay. Because uh, we don't have any other choice. Let's do this thing. Michael Ely takes on Avatar. 
jump on it. Now, it's time to go ahead and get on into the base. I don't have any white, which that's what I would usually use. I don't know where it went. Majalik, my little brother, probably got a hold of it somehow. He's, he's, his, his fingers are sticky. You know what I'm saying? Instead of that, I'm going to use a mix of Honey Beige and Enchanted. So Enchanted is like a shimmery type color, but hey, yeah, it's the Avatar, so maybe it'll give me like an underglow. Who knows? All right, I'm going to pull out my airbrush. We're going to go ahead, got our airbrush on. I'm going to turn that bad boy on. I don't have it like at a specific setting because you know I'm a pro now, but you could keep it at a 90 degree angle. I like to have it a little bit higher so that I can spray a little bit faster. I'm going to go ahead, do the base. A lot of drops of honey beige. If you can count, then count. I might use selenite instead, low key. Dang. Okay, yeah, that's what I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use selenite instead. Although selenite is known to be a little bit more cloggy to the machine, but hey, do what you gotta do. All right, got a few of those bad boys in there. If we can. <gasps> no, no! It sprayed all over my hand. A little bit more loose. I didn't expect it to be that loose. So we probably got about a lot. We have a lot of drops in here. Probably about 20 drops. Like it's almost full. So we're gonna back bubble that very gently. And we have a look. She squirted all over me. Um, we're gonna get right into spraying. Oh, wait. I forgot to put on under eye primer. So I put on under eye Urban Decay's eyeshadow primer potion on all the places that will crease up easily as you can see like it's almost like blurred out you know those spots that i put it on it's really blurred out the spots that i someone like oh god i'm spilling all right i'm gonna just start spraying how airbrush is like literally like so full coverage like this is amazing mm, and there we go we've run out of color it's okay put some more honey beige and some more southern night i ain't gonna lie it got a pretty white like pretty darn white I feel that if you're doing this, you're wearing a shirt you don't really care about. Now, the base down here doesn't have to be like, you know, perfect. I just want to get it good. I really just want my boobs blue. Don't laugh. I want my boobs to be blue. Wow. What a base, all right? All right, blue. Effects blue. So to get the color of the avatar, we're gonna do is we're gonna put like a few drops of blue, a good amount. Okay, I say a few drops because I'm not measuring. I'm just. <laughs> oh gosh, am I insane? Not all the way completely, but apple teeny. Effects blue, some apple teeny. Mm -hmm. Some apple teeny because it's like a bluish green color that they are. Put a few drops of that in there, two or three or four. Gonna back bubble that and see what color we get. Alright, see look, that's the really really pretty blue color we get. The avatar is a little bit lighter than that, so I'm gonna put some honey beige in there. Three drops, I just put in. Okay. Let's see how that looks. Hmm. It's nice, but you want a little bit more blue than that, like a nice light blue. Put some more selenite in there as well. 
<laughs> the base is looking pretty good so far. Okay, this one's lighter, so. And what I did to make it lighter was really I just put more honey beige, a smaller amount of blue, and a little bit more apple teeny. Same amount of selenite though. I'm gonna mix up a little bit more for the body. Then I'm gonna go ahead and with my highlight. So I'm not really just do my makeup like how I usually do it, but in tones of blue. We're having a really good base going. I would say at this point, I'm probably doing about four drops of each color. Make sure you wear clothes you don't care about, y'all, because my good pants are getting messed up right now. YOLO! Mm. Mm -hmm. All right, one more refill, and then I'll be able to do my highlight colors. I find that even though like it's a little bit splotchy, because I didn't like you know I'm not trying to like get it like perfect. You know what I'm saying? It makes it look more natural. And as you can see, I'm talking more stiff because I don't want any of it to crease before it's dried completely. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. A beautiful blue color. All right. Okay, now, <laughs> highlight. A few drops. I'd say like three drops, because it's about to be like a lighter blue. One, two, three, four. Honey beige, because FX blue is a dark blue. One, two, three drops of apple teeny, and two drops. Of selenite. So I'm gonna back bubble that. Mm -hmm. Let's still even a dark blue. We're gonna put some more apple teas. I'm gonna put two more drops and I'll put two more drops of honey beige as well. One more drop of honey beige and then see how that looks. Really get that going in there. Okay, that looks like a little bit better. Okay. No, that's the same blue I had before. So, I'm going to go in with some more selenite. Some more honey beige. Maybe like one more drop. And another drop of apple tea. Because we really want to make this avatar hot for real. Go ahead and back up. And because I don't have white and I'm using honey beige instead, it kind of like muddies the blue a little bit. This nose is going to be really broad, remember, so you want the highlight to be broad as well. And now, I'm going to do the contour. So I'm going to just take FX Blue here, and I'm going to drop a few in there. Then I'm going to back bubble and make my contour now this is where I have to look at a picture of them to make sure that I'm doing it right no 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 huh? no no you can't huh no I'm blue I'm too blue like Thomas. <laughs> oh. Okay? So you gotta get out and let me finish, okay? Okay. Thank you. I love you. I love you. Bye. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and do this nose contour. I know it's a wide nose contour. Now, this is just almost like a rough draft. So we don't have to do it, you know, perfectly. We just have to make our noses look nice and wide. This one is like coming in a little bit too much, but that's okay. Like that, because under here is going to be pink. Then, basically, she has these lines coming in on her face. Alright? You don't necessarily need a stencil on this part, really, but I'm going to do it. Can you see? Mm-hmm. 
what I do is I take the stencil and then I um, go back over it to soften up the line. Okay, so I gotta go here. Can you see? We have three lines there. Bam. So I'm gonna go here now. It's looking a little bit uneven, but it's okay because we're gonna we're gonna go back in with um that same base color and like refine all of this. Okay, good. What I do is I usually take the eyebrow stencil, right? And to get those little reach-ins that she has going on. There, there. So I don't want to just redo this freehand. Um, and she has one coming in like this, like that. I'm pulling right there as well. I'm just a. I'm just. I'm just doing what feels right. This is a trust the process moment, boy, I tell ya. Then I'm gonna go ahead and do, Loki, I don't even need the stencil. I'm gonna just do what I do. It's a little bit uneven, but that's okay. I'm gonna give it like a big old diamond in the middle, you know? At this point, I'm just drawing on my face with the airbrush, if you haven't noticed. Just drawing. I'm going to having fun. What else does she have? These stripes. She has them all over her body. So, ooh, my eyes burning, y'all. Mm. Okay, some more blue. Do the stripes that come in from my neck like this. It don't have to be too perfect off rip. It just needs to look like the general idea. Cause we are gonna go in and clean it up. I'm just going in with these veins coming down. So now I'm going to be going back in with the original color. Go in so I can clean these lines up. Yo Zimmy! Cleaning it up. Mm -hmm. Make these separations a little bit more prominent. I'm gonna soften out this line too. So it looks more like a blend and not just like a harsh line. There's also the part where you wanna use this base color to um, do your roots, right? Because why would we want our scalp to be pink or whatever color your scalp is when the rest of it is blue? No, we want to really sell it. Bobby up, no, not getting that. And I'm Bobby up. Do I Right in there. I hope I'm not ruining it. You're just ruining it. That's no, okay, it looks more natural. Mm -hmm. Now, what I'm gonna do is the highlight highlight. The highlight highlight is going to consist of apple teeny one two drops of that and my regular highlight which is aloha two drops of that apple teeny and aloha remember i didn't clean out the machine not once yet okay just remember that we're giving avatar right but glam you know what i mean like we don't do boring avatar around here she needs to have the highlight so she can really pop for real right in this nose yes right on this cheekbone up here gonna put it right here in the middle so 
what it looks like. You know, like we're beaming for real. Beam me up, Scotty! Mm. Mm. Then we're gonna put a little bit within the, the little spaces here. Shining, 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 yeah. All of this money. Now what are we gonna do? We're gonna do our nose. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick up the color pink. Should I pick up pink or salmon? What do y'all think? I'm thinking more along the lines of salmon. So it's not too, too bright. I don't like when they do the too, too bright color anyway, so. Two drops. Mmm. I made it look a little bit pig-nosed. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back in like right across this line with some dark blue. I also seen that a lot of them did pink lips and she doesn't even have pink lips so I'm not doing pink lips I'm doing dark blue so now I'm gonna actually wash out the pink and then go back in with FX blue remember how FX blue is like a super dark color though what I'm gonna do actually is I'm gonna go with four drops of FX blue one drop of honey beige and one drop of apple teeny just to like soften the color a bit one drop of selenite I don't like the pig nose look. I don't like that. I want to have an avatar nose. I hope this hasn't been too boring for you guys. I feel like I haven't really been talking because I've been so focused on what I'm doing. Oh, this is a little bit too light. With that, I'm going to go ahead and do my eyebrows in the blue. Okay, see? So I'm going to just take the stencil. And it's like business as usual here. This is... I usually do my eyebrows. I'm just really doing the same thing that I usually do. Just blue. You know what I mean. And they're already pretty much primed. So you don't have to do too much there. If you want to see my tutorial on how to do colored brows. I just posted one uh, not too long ago. So see, bomb, fleeked eyebrow. As an avatar, I just feel like you have to have a fleeked eyebrow. You know what I'm saying? And see, because we have that um, highlight under our eyebrows, it acts as like a concealer, and it makes them pop more. It's time for the eyeshadow, which really I probably should have done first, but hey, I'm gonna take the stencil. This is the dark, the same dark one that I did for the right here. Just bring it like that, you know, do a little bit of a smoky eye. <laughs> then. Trying to make it a little bit more even. Then, how should I do this? I'm not used to airbrushing my lips, but this doesn't look half bad. I just find that with airbrushing your lips, it doesn't really last as long. And they be feeling dry. Now. I forgot to put on eyeshadow, but I'm really to like make the green pop. I'm gonna just put two drops of apple teeny. I'm actually going to I'm gonna throw some honey beige in there. And I'm gonna do my signature little eye thing right here in a corner because we are avatars or also bad girl. You know? Yeah. Now, what we're gonna do is finally clean out the airbrush. You want a back bubble, you want to use that brush that you got with your airbrush, dip it in some of the cleaner, then brush out the nozzle. I actually have to go back in on this side. I didn't realize why y'all ain't tell me over here that you could barely see the line. I should have said some. I know what you're thinking. Could I have sprayed this lightly before? Yeah, but I didn't do that, so I digress. What do you guys think? Is it giving? 
you know, so you see I have this big old dotted diamond in I didn't make it like my forehead. Well, I'm gonna take some selenite, one drop, and one drop of honey beige. I'm gonna just put like a nice little ding in the middle of it. Ding! You know? Alright, now we are done in terms of airbrushing, I think. Although, I'm lucky, I'm pretty sure that I had some blush on the last time. Yeah, I'm gonna put on some blush. I'm gonna drop some pink in there. Just like a little bit, you know, nothing too crazy. See, this is purple. I'm gonna drop a piece of purple in there. A drop of pink. Just for a little touch of something. You know, a little, a little touch of something. A little touch of something. Now we're done with the airbrush. After you clean up your airbrush, you're gonna want to leave some solution in there because it's gonna need it. Put on like your uh, your little cleaning thingies that they give you with the pack. Hmm. Maybe I'm not done with the airbrush because I might need to airbrush my eyelashes. Good lord. Well, because we're doing red hair today, which I feel like I wanted to do it with the red hair in because I feel like it like real really make that blue pop off mascara on be careful with the mascara i don't know about y'all but my mascara be doing me dirty you see that pink in my eye we don't like seeing that okay so we're gonna take some white eyeliner uh, gonna go ahead and take out my airbrush again because i have red hair i'm gonna do like brownish reddish eyelashes Cocoa, as well as I'm gonna put in some red. Now I'm gonna take my eyelashes, look at my hand, um, and I'm going to spray the underside. You know, a good little amount. And let's see how that looks. Perfect. Now, I'll take the other one, put a nice little rough spray. I don't know if you guys can see it. I've been really focused like this whole time, so I just really hope this is not too boring for you guys because I'm not talking that much. So, I'm gonna put my glue on it. Why? Y'all good? My fault. My fault. I'm getting serious now, y'all, because I'm hot. Gonna take the eyelashes, put the glue on. Now that we got the glue on the eyelashes, while we wait for it to get tacky, I'm gonna go ahead and take my white eyeliner. <sighs> no. Oh no, guys. Well, it popped out, but it's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and use this. Oh shoot, I almost forgot about the eyelashes. Okay, let's put on those bad boys real quick. So now, I'm gonna take my tweezers and fix them into place because I'm not that good at doing my eyelashes with my fingers when I have long nails like this on. Now, to continue doing what I was doing with these dots, let's finish her up. Now I'm going to go ahead and put on some setting spray. Even though it don't need it because like it's so much makeup that it won't like, you know, just like rub off or nothing like that, but for added protection.
And now, take this off. Okay, so, I don't know if I got what I'm gonna do with my hair. Mm, basic. All right, let's see what uh, this dress looks like that I was gonna put on. Let's see what it looks like. BRB. Okay. So, we're back with the finish. Maja, shut up! We are back with the finished look, y'all. This is what we're giving, okay? Don't wanna look in the back because the black peeking out. I wasn't going to recently wear this, but hey, if it worked, it worked. All right, of course you're gonna look at the bottom and see that blue is the new black, but. <laughs> Other than that, y'all, this was a very successful look. I'm about to go out in public with it and go get me some reactions because I'm not gonna sit in the house with this after I just spent how many hours? Putting this on? I don't know. Three. Three hours, I think. Putting this on. But this is the final result. Give us a little close-up. I just wanted to show it in some lower light really quick. Yeah, guys, I really, really, really hope you enjoyed this video of me turning into an avatar. Super fun to make. Always fun to make videos for you guys. And yeah, let me know what you want more of. Uh, I think Avatar is coming. I don't know when Avatar is coming. I think it's coming out two months from now. But I just wanted to show you guys how I do it. Uh, and I think it turned out really, really good. So thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share it with your little friends. I know. I need to wash my hands so bad. But, um, listen. My hands look like this and my face look like this. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, I hope you guys really, really enjoyed this. To be honest with you. See y'all on the flip side. Jalika out.